Welcome back. I'm Brittany and today we'll be making a one pan chicken sausage and veggie dinner. So, or lunch, whatever you want to use it for. So today all you'll need is a sheet pan that I've lightly sprayed with olive oil. You'll also need some extra olive oil. So we will be doing tossing dal with vegetables and the chicken sausage in. Now I do have this chicken sausage, it is pre-cooked. Um, I just have eight of them. So choose as many as you want. This recipe is actually very versatile, so you can choose different vegetables. This is just my kind of go-to. So we've got some petite potatoes, um, cauliflower, broccoli, red onion, orange bell pepper, red bell pepper, and then for seasonings, garlic powder, oregano. This is my favorite. Old Bay seasoning it tastes great on everything. And then salt and pepper, of course. Also, lastly, after I get done roasting them in the oven, I like to squeeze either lime or lemon on top after all of it is cooked. So, let's get going. Oh, one last thing. The oven is preheated to 375 degrees. So, we'll start chopping all this up, toss it together, put it on the sheet pan, put it in the oven, and dinner will be ready. Before I start chopping, I will just let you know that all the ingredients should be listed when I first was saying all the ingredients, but also just for your shopping list, all ingredients that I'm using today will list in the description. ended up doing the potatoes and some of the chicken sausages in this. So now we will just go ahead and toss them with each of our seasonings. All right, throw this into the oven for 30 minutes. I'm going to actually throw this onto another sheet pan and also throw in the oven with this same one. All right, so I have my second sheet pan and this is just the potatoes and the chicken sausage. The, all the vegetables and some of the chicken sausage are in the oven already. And I will just toss this around and put it in there as well. So dinner shall all be ready in 30 minutes. Okay, it's been about 15 minutes, so we're just gonna pull these out and toss them around. and put them back in for another 15 minutes. Okay, so this was in the oven for about 30, 35 minutes. I will say I'm leaving my potatoes in for a little bit longer. Usually when I have potatoes on with the vegetables, it seems like it steams the potatoes a little bit more, so I just checked them at 30 minutes, the potatoes, with a fork, and some of them weren't completely done. So I'm just letting them roast a little bit longer, and that's gonna be totally uh, up to what you're cooking. So just make sure you keep checking those. And if they need to roast five minutes longer, that's fine. So there you have it though, one sheet pan. It'll be easy cleanup and you're all ready. Um, also one last thing, I like to put a little sauerkraut with this when I'm ready to eat. And like I said before, I squeeze a little lime on top or lemon and it gives it that little zing. So thank you for joining me today. If you make this, please let me know how, what you thought. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you soon.